What is up, guys? It's your boy, Breviar. Yes, yes, yes. I'm preparing for the week. Looking at a couple of pairs I want to warn you guys about. Not in a warning about anything is bad, but a warning that you might be able to make some profit off of these. So the Swiss francs are looking like they're falling. This is the pound with the franc. Um, let's go to the Aussie versus the franc. And this is all in an hour. They all look like they're going to fall. Uh, the franc and the Japan has just been falling. And lastly, the U.S. and the franc, uh, the franc is killing the U.S. right now. But let's get back to the Aussie and the pound. Now, what am I looking for? Well, you see, guys, we're, it pulled down past its resistance, which makes it a support. And it pushed up to hit the support line. This is a perfect entry right here. This is what I call a perfect entry. But since I'm looking on this on Sunday, I'm going to wait until a session open up the London market just to see where this thing is going to go. Because during the Asian market, I think it's going to pull down and push back up during the London market. In this area, in this area are my targets to get into this trade. Now, you could be brave and take the trade right now. But I'm just going to wait a little bit because I'm very cautious about this. I've really never seen a trade like this right before the market is open. So I'm going to be slightly cautious about taking this trade right now. Going back to the Aussie and the Swiss rank. Just the perfect setup. Look at this. It came down and hit the support area, hit this resistance area, and came back and hit the support. This is just perfect entry. I, let's go down to the 15-minute really quick. And the reason why I say I think it's going to push up, if you look at this, we just hit a support line right here. And after that, usually it pushes up. So I'm thinking entry may be up here. And... If you go back to the hour, the entry is right here where they uh, simplicity has their own resistance line. So I'm going to be cautious. I wish it pulled back up here because I will take the trade and put my stop loss somewhere up here. Put my stop loss, stop loss somewhere up here and take the trade on the short. So just to head up on what I'm saying before the market is open. And if you like this algorithm and system that I'm using, there's a link at the bottom of the description. It's a, it's a referral code and will give me something to support my channel. Thank you guys for watching. I'll let you know if I took the trade or what I saw. If you had an opportunity to make $50 to $60 a day by waking up one hour out of your day, would you take that opportunity? And this is what trading in the Forex market gives you. So I'll see you guys later. Peace.